check it out, guys. The sun is rising. And that reminds me of John chapter 1, verse 5, where it says, The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness did not comprehend it. Now, that word comprehend doesn't mean understand, like the darkness doesn't understand the light. It means it can't lay hold of it, can't grasp it, can't extinguish it. You know, the darkness that enshrouded this spot that I'm standing on just minutes ago is giving way to the light. There's not a thing it can do about it. The light wins every time. Jesus, the Bible clearly says, is the light of the world and wherever he is, darkness can't remain. Now, I've been alive for over 60 years and I don't recall a time in those many years that seemed as dark as these days I'm living in right now, that you're living in right now. It seems like the news is bad everywhere. The natural world seems to be falling apart. The political world is in chaos. There's violence on every hand, terrorism, wars, and on and on. And not just in the larger world, but in our small world, our micro world, your world. Things can seem pretty dark at times, can't they? And you can despair. You can start to wonder, where's the hope? But we have this amazing promise. Yes, sir. The darkness did not comprehend it, can't do anything about the light of Jesus. Dear one, let him shine today in your corner of the world. Let his light be on display in your life, what you say, what you do, how you move through this world. And watch what happens. Watch what happens. The sun is rising.